input devices, let's have a quick recap about the things that we learned in earlier classes. Computer is an electronic machine that can do many things easily and accurately. It is made up of two components, hardware and software. Hardware is any part of a computer that we can see and touch. For example, keyboard, mouse, monitor, hard disk, etc. Software are programs stored in the computer. For example, Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Scratch, Google Chrome, etc. Do you know what programs are? Programs are collection of instructions that can be executed by a computer to do a work. Now let us see how a computer works. A computer takes data, processes the given data and gives out meaningful information. Data is what we feed into the computer. Changing the data into meaningful information is called process. After processing, the computer gives back the result. This result is known as output. So, remember children, the working of a computer can be defined by these three steps. Input, process, output. We are starting with our new lesson. Input devices. You are familiar with the word in. Now let us see what is input and what are input devices. The raw facts are instructions that we give to the computer to get back meaningful information is known as input. Input can be of different form. It can be words, numbers, pictures, videos or sounds. But how we feed these inputs? There are special types of hardware devices or computer parts to feed the input. These devices are known as input devices. The most commonly used input devices are keyboard and mouse. Let's move on in detail about the various input devices. Mouse. Mouse is one of the most commonly used input device. It is also called as pointing device as it has got an arrow or pointer to point things in the computer. We can choose our desired options using this pointer. The commands are given using the mouse buttons. The actions given by the buttons are taken as instructions or commands. The different actions are left click, right click, double click and drag and drop. If you want to select an item, we choose left click. To open a program or an item, we choose double click. To get more commands on an item, we choose right click. And if you want to move an item from one place to another, we use the action drag and drop. Keyboard Keyboard is an input device that helps us to feed input in the form of letters, numbers and symbols. It looks like a typewriter and sometimes called QWERTY keyboard as the first row of alphabets are Q, W, E, R, T, Y. The letters, numbers and symbols are arranged on blocks called keys. There are different sets of keys such as alphabet keys, number keys, symbol keys, arrow keys and special keys. Example for special keys are enter keys, backspace key, delete keys, function keys, control keys, alt keys and so on. 
scanner. Scanner is an input device that takes an image of any printed or handwritten page as input. It is stored in several forms that a computer can understand. For example, you can store your class photograph, a picture that you drew, a worksheet that you wrote in the computer with the help of a scanner. Web Camera and Digital Camera Web Camera and Digital Camera are input devices that captures still images and videos. These images and videos are stored in the computer. With the help of Web Camera, we can share images and videos live on the internet. Joystick Joystick is a control device for playing video games. See the vertical handle in the picture? This handle is used to control your game that can be moved in any direction, left, right, forward or backward. While playing games, it is used to move the objects in different directions quickly. Light Pen Light Pen is an input device as well as a pointing device to select objects on the display screen. It is used to draw pictures, shapes and figures directly on the screen. It is mostly used by engineers, fashion designers, architects, etc. Microphone Microphone is an input device used to record voice or sound into the computer. Recorded sound gets stored in the computer. You can keep your narrated story, a beautiful song sung by you in the computer with the help of a microphone. Barcode Reader Barcode Reader is an input device. You might have seen this device in shops and hypermarkets. It is a type of scanner that scans the data contained in the barcode and sends the details to the computer's memory. Dear children, we have discussed about various input devices. Try to find out more input devices other than these. See you in the next session. Stay safe, stay healthy.